Yo, what is going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Today we're taking a closer look at the Gucci Kingsnake polo shirt and the double G buckle belt. As always, I'll start off by giving you some background information regarding both the products. After this, we'll go outside and do a fit review just so you can see how it fits on body and get a sense of what size you should go for. And hopefully by the end of the video, you'll have a better idea of what it's like to purchase either of these two items. We'll start off by taking a closer look at the polo shirt, which is on the left hand side here. So the Gucci Kingsnake polo retails for £490. As the name suggests, it does feature the Kingsnake embroidery around the neck, below which there's a golden bee embroidered. If you are familiar with Gucci products, you would have seen that bee elsewhere. So for example, on their Gucci Aces. Speaking of which, I have reviewed two different models of the Gucci Aces. So if you haven't watched those videos, I will leave a link in the top right now where you can go and watch that. The polo shirt also features a double G collar button, is 93% cotton and 7% lycra. This mix of materials gives the polo shirt a more slim fitted feel and look while still maintaining enough flexibility for you to be comfortable. I will talk a bit more about the fit and size and recommendations in more depth shortly after the fit review, but for now let's move on to the Gucci belt. So upon opening the box you will have your usual Gucci dust bag. You also have a little booklet inside which just has some extra details and you will get a thank you card as well. The strap used for this Gucci belt is calfskin leather. It's been heat stamped to give you the textured appearance that you see here. This particular belt is four centimeters in width, but you can get this exact same model in both three centimeters in width and I think two centimeters in width as well. Although the difference in width is only a few centimeters, it can give the belt a completely different look. So do bear that in mind when you are picking whichever one it is you want to get. Last but not least, you have the golden double G buckle, which I believe is made from brass. The tone of the finishing is quite nice as it doesn't have that gold look which really really stands out way too much. That might be your thing but this one has more of a duller type look to it and as a result this belt has more of a discreet finish while still being able to catch attention. Now that I've covered the basics of both products we can jump straight into the fit review. Just for your reference and to help you with sizing the Gucci belt in this video is a size 90 and the polo shirt is a medium. The model wearing the products is 6 foot weighs 77 kg and has a size 32 waist. So of course, after wearing the products, I did ask the model what he thought about both pieces and here are his comments. So starting with the belt, he was very impressed with the leather quality, felt very solid, fit just like any regular belt. Moving on to the polo shirt, as I did mention, it is made from cotton and lycra, which gives it that stretchy, slim fit type feel and look. He specifically mentioned it was very tight on the biceps, so if you've got bigger arms, you might want to size up. He also said the polo shirt was very lightweight so that makes it ideal for summer obviously and despite the polo shirt being black it didn't get too hot or anything like that so positives all around. If you do want to try getting these products below retail to save you some money because you don't feel like they're worth the retail price then do check out some online marketplaces. There are a number of Instagram personal shoppers you could get them from as well. What I would advise you to do though is make sure you're educated on the product so you know how to go around and spot fake so you're not getting scammed. That sums up the content I had planned for you in this video. I hope this has given you a better idea of what to expect when purchasing either of these two products. Let me know down in the comments what you think of both products and whether you cop them or not. And with that being said, I'll see you all again on the next video. Peace.